All right. Went to the bathroom. Took a wicked yes. I'm still stuffed up as fuck. But we have more robots to smash. Commentary for hours probably doesn't help. Listen, you. Listen. Listen, you. I should be sleeping right now, but I should. <laughs> I honestly probably should, but whatever. I don't know how it work tomorrow. So meh. Alrighty. Meanwhile. kind of contract we finna be getting here. I just want to go to the uh, black market stores to see if I could find more Atlas pieces. Because if we can get an Atlas and a Battlemaster now, holy crap. <laughs> oh, that'd be, that'd be something special. Fire in the barracks. Oh god, Coyote. Coyote, you fucking brave soul. Whipping out a dusty fire extinguisher. Ky Are you feeling brave, buddy? You feeling brave? <laughs> you feeling lucky? Oof. Welp. <sighs> Morale decreased by two. That's a big yikes. That's a big yikes. <laughs> Furries and fire don't mix. Your fucking fursuit caught fire halfway through, goddammit. I told you to take it off! I told you to take it off. Except for special occasions, but goddammit, you don't listen to me. Here we go. 
Fuck! I told you you should only leave the fursuit to parties and special events, but no, you insist. I'm just glad you don't wear it when you're out in combat. Or at least it's mandatory to wear the pilot's uniform when we're out in combat. Fucking Christ. At least it wasn't that big of an injury. At least, it, at least you were able to stop, drop, and roll around on the floor. Damn it! There's a king crap part here, though. The hell is this? Napalm missile launcher? They don't create enemies that do not do actual damage. Oh, well, that's lame. Assassinate in the desert, battle in the desert, capture base, polar. Huh. Are we gonna have allies here? That's an interesting thought. You'd think a giant missile screaming towards you, even if it is an incendiary missile, would still do some if damage. You know? If only minimal. Command interface initiated. Alpha Lance. Dance force up ahead and help us somewhere in this area. To clear the enemy lines, just regroup at this location. Oh, right. Listen, mercenaries. Do us a favor and stay out of the way. That the wow. Left rule, boss shit. I'd say let all. Let them take all the enemy fire up. Let's over time hours for my crew. Just sneak near them and keep them alive. It doesn't matter who gets the kills as long as the professionals make it back more or less intact. Set up Alpha, let's go this AO and go home. 
There we go. Natural chair, natural cover your advance, and I won't be necessary. Here we go. We got this. Just stay put and keep out of our fields of fire. So we get Armageddon, but we're under contract too. And you can lift off and collect your payment. Armageddon out. Yikes. Jesus Christ, guys. Chill. Good to go. A little bit snarky there. I don't like it. You don't even have a full lance. You have three motherfuckers there. Hot talk coming from coming from someone. Like, yeah, a lot of talk coming from someone in a mech made of paper fucking mache. Like I'm pretty sure the flea has more armor than you. Jesus. Like I'm pretty. the hell is that one though an archer never seen that before it must be one of the new mechs yeah here comes the freaking paper mech Mleh. swear to god if these motherfuckers end up backstabbing us I will be one very unhappy commander. I'm rolling. Location confirmed. Meow. Hey, Salem. Meow, meow. Eddie. Oh, I didn't even see the fleet. <laughs> yeah, it's so small it blended in with the trees. <laughs> They're in the happy little trees. They're in the... Hello, Drabalin. God, this is just one giant clusterfuck of goddamn initiative phases. Because we have my lance, we have the Davian lance, we have the Turian lance, and then we have the, like, the, 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 whoever the, like, fist people are. Whoever the, the Commonwealth people, I think. God. Well, at least one of them hit. I like how they told us to keep out of the line of fire, but here we all are up here. Jesus Christ! Ah. Oof, that's rough terrain. Don't want to go there. Go, Laser Master!
dinky little flea. Oh, you're fine. You're in a fucking battle, Lancer. Yeah. Wait, right, come on. It's a locust. Commander, I'm seeing new content. It's probably the littering lance. Now people got another lance in the AO, so we'll need to intercept them before they can flank us. I don't think he's listening to our content at all. Commander, better go handle that second lance before they do some real damage. You're not even shooting anybody. Uh oh. Stop. Oof. Target confirmed. That's a hit. I don't look like it hurt. Enemy net. Critical damage detected. Flee. Really? 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 <laughs> you really, you, you really finna be doing that right now there, Chief. You... Smack him in the anus. Here we go. Target down, Commander. His tiny mech has no arms. He'd be going for a kick against that mech three times his size. Oh, that's a Shadow Hawk. Oh, that's a Shadow Hawk. Yep, that's a shit. Yeah, I, yep, that's a shadow hawk. Yeah, I get it. That is a. Hmm. That is. Good to go. Let's move. Brave little toaster.
Oh, that's a Wolverine. Uh. Commander. On it. Well, it looks like this guy has the same idea. Go for the Shadow Hawk. Timber! I'm just gonna dash into cover with the trees. You know, because a giant battle master can hide in these tiny little trees. Uh. Oof. That's a bit of a whiff there, Chief. <coughs> oh, wait, that's the enemy. Uh. It's like, hang on a minute, why the hell is our friendly fleet trying to- Oh, wait. Why the- Never mind. <laughs> I thought it was the friendlies finally turning on us or something. Oh, uh, I was really confused there for a minute. Is that Cicada ever going to do anything important? Light damage, Commander. Try aiming next time, see what you get. What, did somebody try to shoot Coyote? I didn't, I didn't think somebody tried to shoot Coyote. Maybe it was a stray shot. Who knows? Who effing knows? Excuse me. Wow. Minimal damage on that hit. Hi there. Engaging physical attack. Boom. <laughs> I just like how that's a pink flea. That is a pink flea. Fun fact, you strip all the weapons off of Sakata, you can't even max its armor with the free tonnage you get. Yikes. It's that bad, huh? <clears throat> no weapons. Just still can't do anything with it. Oh, hey, Unreal, how you doing, fam? Nice to see ya. Oh, well, that man's dead. I hope we can salvage that. Yeah. 
Doing alright, how about yourself? I'm feeling a little under the weather today. Got a... A little very congested with my nose and my sinuses. And my sinus and stuff, so... Uh, if I sound a little bit awkward and I'm sniffing a lot, I'm sorry. <sighs> Can't help it. God, you, yes, you had your first stream yesterday? Hell yeah, brother. What'd you, what'd you stream, fam? What'd you play? Quiet side? Hell yeah. Tiny little laser. How'd it go, fam? You had four viewers at some at one point with your first stream? Bro, I am jealous AF. I'm jealous AF, fam. Four viewers on your very first stream. Turns out it was a pilot I met on Miller a few months ago. That's cool. I've been streaming for like two years. I normally have like one to two max. Yeah, for me it really depends on what game I'm playing. Just DM'd a couple friends on Twitch to announce my presence. It really depends on what the game is. It's kind of sad when you think about it that people really watch me for the game and not, like, me as a streamer. Which is understandable, but it's still kind of, you know, it hurts a little bit. Like, just so happens I'm, uh... Just so happens, you know, I'm, like, streaming Battletech, so, you know, somebody drops in, just sees me play Battletech, follows me the next day I play Plant Side or something, and they don't show up, you know, they're all... It could be life reasons, but it's like, I don't know. There's a lot of variables to it, so I don't let it bother me too much. Could be a schedule, could be, you know, he just doesn't like plant side, who knows. But yeah, I try not to let it bother me, but it's still sitting in the back of my head, you know. Right, like, I don't let it bother me too much, but it's still there, right? I can't simply ignore it. Or it's hard to simply ignore. Oh boy, we got a... We got a Reddit here. Hang on. I'll watch that as soon as this uh, turn here is over. Mm. Really, dude? That's what you go for? Showing up to the party to stone and finding the dog. <laughs> Oof. Wallop! <laughs> and then he gets knocked down again. <laughs> That's funny. But it's good to hear your first stream went well, fam. Welcome to the world of streaming. Maybe one of these days I'll be able to, uh, be able to watch, uh, be able to tune into one of your streams and return the favor that you've been, uh, showing me the past couple, couple months, past few months even. I really can't tell how people find these turn-based games enjoyable. Well... Some people can't, some people can't tell how some people find 
find the high-paced, high-action games like first-person shooters enjoyable, so it's all a matter of preference. That is really just a matter of opinion, fam. Helps when you know that's true, too. Trying to use it down, good guys made it out, that's all that matters. Mission successful. And sometimes with high paced first person shooters, people feel too overwhelmed, like they don't know what to do, and then they just they just get too stressed out and they just leave. So, you know, it's all a matter of preference really. Shall we finish that dra dra Yes, the drabbelin, of course. Either that, or I can get a Wolverine, which is probably worth more. I should have scrapped the Vulcan and not the Wolverine. Fuck! Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, well. Here, it's too slow. Yeah, I mean, people can't get bored with playing turn-based strategy games like this. But, I mean, my channel is kind of based around first-person shooters. My channel is based off of first-person shooters and strategy games. So it's like I kind of feel the advantages and disadvantages the both. But someone who's just starting out with playing one type of game or the other, I can totally see how uh, how uh, people may get overwhelmed or bored with one or the other. But uh, yeah, it's a concern that I kind of play both genres a lot on my channel. I guess I can see the uh, opinions of both worlds. But to someone outside of my position... It's, uh, it can go one way or the other, you know, it just depends on what your preference is and what kind of gamer you are. But you know what, Unreal? At least you get to watch it from a third-person perspective and not play it yourself, so... There you go. I guess there's that, so... Sexually identify as an epic gamer. Yeah, I should have sold the Vulcan and not the Wolverine. Idiot! No. Oh, guess. Well, Coyote, hopefully you're good with a Vulcan. <laughs> A tiny little Vulcan compared to the fucking Centurion you used to drive. It's only temporary, though. I sexually identify as a fat loner. What are your orders, Skipper? Copy that, Commander. 
Play some planet side. All right, fam. Thanks for hanging out. Good luck with future streaming, fam. Keep your eyes peeled, Commander. This looks like an ideal place for an ambush. Right. I don't want to have to run through the rough yeah. terrain. You can't fit through there. Come on. Confirm. Acknowledge. Look alive. We've got company. On my way. Who this boy? Yaugamek! Is the Yaugamek! I actually kind of want that. I want the Yauga! Now a Yauga mech could definitely replace, could definitely replace my, uh, my Vulcan any day of the week. Good luck killing the pilot, though. Roger that, Commander. Good morrow, sir. Oh boy. Oh boy, I just realized all the shit up here. Oh, I think I may have just put Kyle in a bad situation. Guess your best bet is to punch the frick out of him. Assassin. Is it just me or is the assassin the only one with, like, unique animations? Because it's like... Hang on, hang on, wait for it. Wait for it. Come on, do your fancy shit. Do your fancy shit. There you go, that stuff. Yeah, it's like he's the only one with like truly unique animations. Unless there's other mechs that got changed. The crab clamps his little claws. Yeah, I mean, but the crab isn't that new, is it? Sh 
stray shots are hitting the building. Smaller medium crabs from the first DLC. Ah. Alright, I have to remember though, the Yauga mech is a bit scary though in his armament. Ow! It's okay, I can take him. Oh, that's a lot of lerms. Ooh, that's a scary amount of lerms! Holy shit! Uh-oh. Coyote, it's bad enough you almost burnt yourself alive in the fucking barracks with your goddamn fursuit. I don't think you're very... I don't think you're very lucky today there, Chief. I don't... You. Target acquired. Oh, come on, at least hit one. Reporting critical hit. Confirm. Good morning. Good morning, Vietnam. LRM. No wonder he had so many lerms. Ah! Took a hard hit there. Yeah, yeah, you did. Fuck. I like how Coyote is just the cockiest motherfucker in our entire alliance.
Oof. Oof. My internals are taking a beating. Confirmed. Just delete this guy. Enemy down. Mmm. Armor breach. Internal damage. God, here comes that LRM person. Fuck! Warning. Armor breached. Internal damage. Yes, Internal structure damaged. Good to go. A fucking thunderbolt too, because why not? Ugh. Got a weapon out. Fuck. We weren't living that. Not with that Thunderbolt there. Not with that, like, fully armored Thunderbolt there. That Thunderbolt sealed the deal. Minus 12. Fuck. Yeah, they really don't like it when that happens, huh? Damn it. Damn it. Right. I'll get it in the skin. Wow, we lost a lot of weapons there. It's 
Is it even worth repairing? You know what, you're right. Probably pick up a better mech from the store in all honesty. You could pick up another battle master or get close to one. Maybe if I sell my soul a little bit. King Crab. I'm thinking even another bat I'm thinking either another battle master or a King Crab. Battle Master or King Crab, what should we go for? Keep your eyes out for a flashpoint called Prototype. The Defector. Joint Venture. Unwelcome Guests. Prototype! This is it, isn't it? A raven. Should I go for it? Do you think I could go for it with the mechs I have now? Right, because by the time we get there, all my mechs are going to be repaired, right? I have the Battlemaster, Centurion, Shadowhawk, and a Hunchback. You think I could get it with these mechs? You think I should uh, go for it? Will be tough but doable. By your command. God damn it. Gonna have two financial reports go off by the time we get there. Probably three. Do you think I'll need more pilots? I have five. I have five. 
Hmm. Pilots get wounded, they can't go on the rest of the missions? Damn. Great Death Legion. Nah, I ain't letting them leave. I'm not losing one of my best freaking pilots to a, uh, to a random event. Fuck that. They disobeyed me and left to run off with them. Got a new financial report for you, Commander. If that would have happened, I probably would have had to cancel the flashpoint and like stick around. Little game of poker of the mail. Uh, so much travel. Do, 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 there we go. Moonlighting with an auto cannon. Coyote, stop fiddling around with things! Every time one of these stupid events come up, it's you! It's always fucking you! <laughs> God damn it, dude! Stop being in all the weird stuff! <laughs> Jesus Christ! First it's trying to put out a fire in a fursuit. 
No, no, no. First it's painting a mural of Darius on a wall. Next, it's putting out a fire in a fursuit. Now it's a moonlighting with an auto cannon. I'm about to bust. Oh. Suppose it was a source for a reason we can further things go bad. Just be careful these weapons are meant to destroy Max after all. Well, we get word from Kyle Kins in the med bay. We can visit him. He's grinning ear to ear despite the bandages. I did it. I can't have been purring like a kitten. A kitten that wants to kill Max. I managed to replace the poor respects of the Kyle tactical auto cannon. Plus five damage. Well, there you go. <laughs> Moonlighting with an auto cannon. Freaking coyote. Ah, man, we don't have enough people for the fuck. Damn it, dude. <laughs> It doesn't expire for that, that, okay, you know what? Coyote, I freaking need you for this, fam. Ready to go over financials whenever you are. I kind of need you for this, Chief. I you can wait and take a nap. <laughs> All right. Prototype, high orbit. Commander, before we begin, you must understand that the matters we're about to discuss are to be held in the highest confidence. You are not to repeat anything you told today, not to anyone or ever am I understood. Professional, of course, Commander, we know we'll have to keep our mouth shut. Very good, Mr. Libya, I'll hold you to it. Six months ago, I had a blah, 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 contacted from the blah, 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 so a prototype battle, I'm like a raven from the blah, 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 blah. And they're very time they have labored on behalf of blah, 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 to reverse engineer, presumably for the benefit of the army. Now the blah blah blah, our lane seeds to blah blah blah, and they're on the verge of taking the prototype back if they also see them when we need to access the revolutionary new to for Raven built upon for the sake of the inner sphere as a whole. We can allow that to happen. If you want to find the Raven, recover it and bring it back to me. What is this Raven? Now let's run a warfare platform battle mech for us in since it's rough to you see a whole suit again, change it to the line, packed in the chassis of a single high speed scout. As I said, it's prototype stage, the comparison starts out the blah 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 Well, this is true, why we should wait for the eleventh hour to do anything about it. The free world if we don't sooner or good, I've acted sooner regrettably, the blah 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 and the blah 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 and the the I have da 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 when you locate the rape and bring it back to being one piece of that end, you will run the boo with problem lines of the fifth the friend is a blood, the blah 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 is the nice of mine is operated by da da da. If any contact is going to turn against the da da da, so your own answer patriots will not prioritize the bleed as a whole over the da 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 da. Suppose this is that we could trust these people. Suppose I trust anyway, Bravo Lance has been fully da 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 da. Very good, bring me to Raven, your company will be rewarded. I'll speak with you again once your attack is, is complete. First opponent will take you a field alongside Armour and the rest of Bravo Lance together. You'll sweep the L Frost, only eliminating any units you find along the way. Bravo Lance has done a great deal of punishment over the past few months. 
need your help to cover this deployment in one piece. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Welp. Crud. I guess we have to go out with this, huh? I don't like that. Yeah, the weight limit. Probably should have kept the Vulcan then. Crap. The hell happened here? Here we are, Exos. Got Bravo Lance on the comms. The drop bunch of a front to launch. Really, do appreciate the assistance, Rails, but being the hell I'm over back. This is that the enemy isn't doing much better. Troop be told, I don't think we could have survived another deployment. Got mechs on the ground, Commander. Be ready to advance on the kill of it when you are. Hey, guys. So what do they have? Spider, trench bucket, griffin, javelin. I'm there. Copy that. Good enough. Hopefully, they don't all have weight limits. Oh, great, we get to squish a bunch of cars again, Lamau. Receiving you. Ready to rock.
Okay, so they're all the way over here. Drop out, try to unmark the one who's doing reinforcement. Santa has decided to join the party. I hate pirates. Oh, you're brave there, little spider. You are brave. Ugh. A little bit frame ratey here.
Oh shit! Those two are attacking each other. I know this isn't Battle Mac, but sometimes I wish the Mac had or the Atlas from the franchise was modded into XCOM 2 for Sparks. I feel like this Sparks never got cosmetic love. Standard peeps always get it. I've seen a few uh, Spark customizations. I've seen a few Spark customizations in the past, but uh, yeah, it'd be cool if Sparks got a little bit more love. I definitely agree with you there. There's not enough people use Sparks to really care about them, I guess. But uh, how are you doing tonight, Dave? Good to see you again. It's a 2v1v1. This is like Better Raiders World all over again. This is like... Everybody be kung fu fighting! I need a new target. I know that there was a spark, uh, like a photo booth spark pack that came out on the workshop recently for War of the Chosen. Waiting. So at least that's something, right? Right? right, right. This is just a giant clusterfuck of everything happening at once. This is a literal war zone going on. Walking on Solid connection on that one. Oh my god, more of them? Fuck! Alright, well, at least the main guys are dead. Uh oh! Gotta watch yourself, little boy! No, don't hit the fucking civilian building. I don't care about the civilian building. It's a Mac! Gotta love those enemy of my enemy moments. That's why I love doing. That's why I love doing the Raiders World and a better Raiders World runs for XCOM 2. Just all those three-way epic battles that we got. Commander. I know you can Back hear on. me on this channel, Makarov. Have you ever heard of the saying, the enemy of my enemy is my friend? Oh shit, speaking of heat. <sighs> but people got another loud reinforcement lance on the field. Jesus Christ, on a cracker. Please tell me this is the last line of reinforcements. Sometimes I find it hard to destroy Raider Faction HQ since it's so fun having them around. Yeah, I didn't attack a single Raider Faction HQ in both A Better Raiders World and the original Raiders World playthrough. I didn't attack a single uh, HQ because it's, it's just nice having them. I have a couple of uh, mod concepts on my YouTube channel for uh, other Raider factions. Like I have a like a Rogue Advent kind of Raider faction. I have the, of course, the Stick War one, which is all the Stick people. Coyote keeps laughing at me about. <sighs> so yeah, 
Although the Sick War one adds in three diff three new teams. One I like to XCOM, one I like to Advent, and then one that's just a Raider faction. Which is why I want it to be done so bad because, you know, it's such a big and expansive mod. It's like uh, it's like three different enemy mod packs combined into one. Someone wants to get dead. Someone requires deadening, so we will dead -a -dead -a dead them. Well, that guy's flying. He's a bird. He's a plane. He's a light mech with jump jets. <laughs> Please tell me this is the last of the reinforcements, though. Whoops. So congested! Wraith is playing space engineers. That's a lot of missiles, Chief. That's. You're a brave little spider. Wallop. Here we go. What's up, boss? Moving to position. On it. That's a lot of damage. Down he goes. Confirm. Wallop him. Wallop. Almost looks like it missed. <laughs> Sick him. What you gonna do, fam? He's just he's just bracing for impact. He knows what's about to happen. He knows he's about to be screwed six ways to Sunday. Hit him again, Kyle! Hit him. Oh my god, finally we're done. <laughs> I 
And the gods for that, that was a, what a shit show this is. First how Yaki's at the door and then Santa can find him. What's next? The, the damned fed rats. Not if I can help, but we're going to find the raven, grab it, wipe out every trace of the black research project. Is the for to put the da da da. Coming message. Commander, please contact me when you reach a safe altitude. We need to talk. Mission successful. Whew! Well, that was a monk of S and a half right there. But thankfully, it was all pretty light mech, so. We all just shot him from a distance and then pummeled him to the ground. Okay. Assassin. Assassin, you say? Assassin. Or I could get a Shadow Hawk. Or I could get a full Shadow Hawk. You know what? If we get the Shadow Hawk, it'll be a mech that we can deploy just in case. Prototype 2. Proto harder. And you were speaking with me. I don't know what I'm going to miss in the pro rival state, but we are in living in times. I'm my lieutenant spotted you fighting alongside attachment of the fifth defenders of Thing, which I'm sure you fought honorably in case you're supporting this. The case that you were supporting is anything but honorable. The dust stole something of great value from House Lyle. We want it back. You'll pay a great deal of money to grab this. Return it to me. See that you do if you return what is ours. Put it in the fun, not now for a memorial. Receive generous compensation for your services. Of course, money, political asylum for your friends, whatever you may need. Consider my offer, Commander. I don't want your blood on my hands. Lead an interesting life. Military types don't get the luxury of negotiating with Op 4. Usually skip the perceivable and jump straight into senseless violence. So next is simply find out where that place is keeping the own prototype. I can't tell you how to do that. Something I'm going to need from you in return. It is enough to steal Raven. See the Raven from my wheels. need to wipe out every trace of the bullet resources. The other guys have to tear to get part. This is what our client is paying for. We're going to steal a raven out stop a war. That's too bad because you can't get the raven without our help and we won't lift a finger if you won't help us protect our home. You won't, huh? Odd since you take for a bunch of soldiers just to agree to turn against their own government. Great to the deal because actions were putting uh, people at risk. We got damn defenders out there. We saw our north protest. We're going to do it. Da, 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 da. Alliance is going to open another research. We can't go to what they can do and fail. It's your choice. Let me see. Add I. Frankly, we're going to need all the help. We just saw the appointment. The project is bringing all the great houses out of the woodwork. We know which we got to tell on the line he wants to talk to us about training to suffer for one of his favorite mercenaries. Simple recovery, he says. I'm right, we do. I'm sending you the details. Convoy, you should take that find where the intel location of the prototype. Oh, you're with me. Keep the. the blah, blah, blah. You know what we have to do? Let's get, get done, get hunted, and see you on the other side. Oh boy.
God damn it. I hate deployment limits. Re oh, well, I'm gonna scrap the assassin before we go, though. Get out of my mech bay. Uh. I'm gonna go for a bit more money here. Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna dance around in the Shadow Hawk. Aw, oh, come on. Seriously? How the fuck are we at. What? How? How? That. Oh my god, that's so stupid. That is so stupid! What the hell? How is that even a thing? Ugh! Oops. This is probably gonna all be the last mission of the night, guys. I'm getting really tired and my fucking congestion isn't getting any better. Have you tried Phoenix Points? I have! I've been playing through it the past few days. Actually played it, uh, actually played it, I was actually playing it a few hours ago before switching to Battletech.
When I first saw the armor for Phoenix for New Jericho, I thought the other way is around. I definitely like New Jericho's armor more. New Jericho armor reminds me of Plant Side 2 New Conglomerate armor. It does. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Standing by. You see? Moses agrees. Copy that. Whoa, mobile HQ. Really makes me wish there was a lot of plant side armor for plant side for XCOM 2. Actually, somebody released new conglomerate armor for XCOM 2. Sadly, they're not going to do any of the other factions, which kind of sucks because I'd love to see all three faction armor in XCOM 2. But yeah, somebody recently did, uh, somebody recently did the, uh, fucking, what do you call it? The NC armor for XCOM. I immediately subbed the last, that thing. Like, hell yeah. Yeah, I just wish they'll do the uh, the other two factions armor. And with the little red versus blue between Advent and them. I definitely hope somebody does the uh, TR and VS armors, if not the same person. Ah, oh, fuck. Shit, that's not good. Using lots of armor. This way, I just hope they'll add even more NC cosmetics since there was a lots of them last time I played Plant Side 2. I want the other two factions in more than a specific faction's armor. Oh my god, these vehicles are so annoying. Ready to rock. I'm on him. It's go time. Frag the vehicle. Receiving you. I mean, if somebody adds the other faction armor, I could do like a plant side themed XCOM 2 campaign. Fuck. My armor's getting stripped off. How unlucky do they have to do that? 
You know, which I heard plants are technically out of four of the access merch for the other four five. Yeah, essentially what it is. If you play as a nanite systems operative, you essentially get placed into the uh, lowest popped faction when you first join in. Pretty cool feature, but it's for members only, so a lot of people don't like it for that reason. I just think they should stop being butthurt and accept it for what it is. I can't take much more of this. Yeah, I heard there's a bit of a mix of reactions, but during the reason why it's been implemented, but I understand why it's a membership thing. Skipper. Standing by. Aye, aye. Going to bed, I sleep a good night. Alright, see you later, Kyle. Thanks for hanging out. pisses me off. Come on, they're vehicles. They shouldn't be that well defended. Damn it. Stop attacking the hunchback. Weapon system down. Fuck. Try aiming next time. See what you get. Stop it! Internal structure damage. Receiving you. Move into position. Locked on for physical attack. Damn it. Ah, uh, he's done. He's out. Knockdown's gonna kill him. Yep, there he goes. Fuck. Yeah, in mean, this game, is like XCOM and having an XCOM. Are they, are they aware and do they reckless moves just to kill a soldier or two? Damn it! Oh, fuck! This sucks. Firing.
I'm just gonna pretend that string of missions didn't happen. I'm just gonna re I'm just gonna no. God, I mean Man, tonight has not been the night for strategy games. A lot of safe scumming in Phoenix Point. Now I'm safe scumming with this game. Jesus Christ. I'm just going to pretend that none of that happened and move on. Oh, man. Sometimes it just doesn't work out. Sometimes it just doesn't work out. Alright guys, I'm feeling like crap anyway, and that string of bad missions in both Phoenix Point and Battletech did not help, so I'm just going to call it here for the day. I'm sorry, I shouldn't keep going like this. I probably shouldn't have even streamed tonight with how fucked up my sinuses are and all that stuff, so I'm just going to call it here. Sorry about all the raging and all the safes coming, but sometimes it just happens. Hopefully next time will be better. So, uh, thank you all for watching, lurkers, followers, those of you on YouTube, and I'll see you next time I'm out. Peace.